Welcome back guys, we are continuing this Commonwealth Challenge campaign where we are only using Commonwealth troops. So if you haven't seen the first two episodes, we are basically trying to cut up here and then circle these. And I've left all of this area completely exposed. They haven't actually attacked in these territories in the past two turns which is a bit weird but the idea was if they take all of these territories around here that's going to extend their front line which will then thin out the rest of the troops don't know if it's going to work or not it's worth a go so we are attacking Bastogne next they have been very kind and only left two cores here so Let's get it on. Okay, so we're just setting up in the middle so our light artillery can reach all four points. And then I'm hoping that they're going to try and attack B. They probably won't attack C because of these here. And they're not going to attack A because of all these here. But fingers crossed they'll try and come across and attack B. Our plan is to go up into these trees and take Y. And then hopefully they're going to spawn in here and come towards me and I can shoot them in the open. But they're likely going to spawn from over here, which would kind of ruin the plans a little bit. But I'm going to leave some troops in these trees here to kill them as they're spawning in, hopefully. So let's go with three divisions to begin with, or three pairs. So I'm going to want to kill these in here. So that's where I'm going to send the planes. Now, I'm almost certainly going to get attacked with artillery. So I'm going to have to prepare for that. Stand by for orders. We're moving. Just want to see if I can get into and these trees. The Hopefully these can't shoot me. It's very close, but I think we should be okay. We have new orders. Get moving. They haven't fired artillery at me. There we go. Company, halt. We need to go. Oh dear. Oh dear. He's going to get hit. Oof. Look at them bodies. <laughs> I have to admit, I do enjoy watching the bodies fly like that. <laughs> it's a bit sick. But it is enjoyable. <laughs> okay, let's see if we can get in these trees now. We have new orders. Move out. Right, it's time to Load for anti -air bring in the air wings. Ready for anti ground mission. This sortie we target we their ground forces. All together. Look for moving ground to hopefully new orders. They can't be seen that. Doesn't look like they can. Ready bombers. Harass their infantry lines. Now he's probably gonna get shot with artillery. I'm going to have to keep an eye on that. Yep, there it is. There's the second one. Let's see if we can sneak around. In fact, I could just wait there, actually, so I don't get in range of these. Okay, let's... Well, the harassment planes still haven't killed everyone yet, so... Let's just continue with that for the minute. I've 
Unfortunately, the bomber didn't deal with these. Got a little bit of shots off on him. Hopefully the bomber will come back and finish the job. Ready for Very good. Okay, I think we should be okay to come in. Now they are bringing troops in here. This is where I was hoping that I'd be able to shoot them as they come in. That's nice. So I think I might leave a couple of troops here. We have more orders. Stand by for Stop orders. To shoot them as they're coming in. Let's see if that works. Marvellous. And then I'll bring these out. Oh. Looks like I haven't hotkeyed these. That could have been bad. Alright, let's carry on bringing some harassment in. Doesn't look like they've left anyone here. Ah, uh, I put them a little bit too close, unfortunately. So they've ended up in a stalemate. Oh, they have got someone here. Attention. Ready on the line. We have new orders. On the line. So, as soon as I move the troops there, they're going to get shot. So I'm going to see if I can bring these up. Now, obviously, we are running out of time a little bit. I've got the time of pause there, though. Attention, on the line. Ah, damn it. I looked away. I knew it was coming. I thought I'd have a little bit more time. Right. Let's bring in... In fact, no, I'm not going to bother bringing in bombers. Attention. Oh dear, I'm just about to get hit with artillery again. We have new oh dear, that's painful. That is painful. Get out of there. We're moving. We have new orders. Get moving. Quick march. Stand by for the orders. Wants this piece of ground. We need to go. Okay, so I'm going to bring harassment in over here infantry ground support ready for anti ground mission ready that's all good attention the double now we have new orders we have new orders move out Okay, time to move. Interesting, they can actually aim the artillery there, can they? Right, well, they don't seem to be bringing any troops from this direction. So let's see if we can get in and take out that artillery. Alright, let's send some more planes in this, this direction. Look for moving ground targets. I 
I'll come back and deal with X once I've taken out the artillery. Now we already know that these aren't safe from the artillery, so let's start moving them. My god, it felt like they took forever to get out of that trench. <laughs> well, I think we're pretty good there. I wonder if these planes are actually shooting. Yeah, they are. So, let's bring some over in this direction. I don't think they've got too much left. Could have send a, a couple of bombers out. Okay. Ready yourselves. I think it might be a good idea to actually take out X. In fact, no, I've still got this artillery here. Let's take out this artillery first. Okay, so we're out of supply now. Attention here. We have new orders. This position is ours. We have new orders. We need to hold this. So I'm just gonna move in with everybody and just use artillery to suppress. Yeah, it looks like the planes might have cleared everybody out, which is marvellous. Yeah, looks like they're all dead. So, I don't know if they've still got more in here, but I haven't really got the supply. We can send one in. See if he shoots. No, I can't see any shots, so I think they are all dead there. Okay, marvellous. I think I might just send a couple of damaged units over. I don't think they've got anybody there. And then the rest can just come back over here. And we can take X. Have new orders. We're pulling back. Stand by for orders. On the line. 
So the, the harassment planes didn't shoot, so I'm pretty confident that there's no one here, but I can always just get the light artillery prepared. Yep, no one here. Doesn't even look like the MG nest survived. That's wonderful. So, let's bring these down to X. Now, I don't actually know if they've got any troops here or not, because I haven't sent a plane here for a while. But we've got artillery, so... We should be fine. This is ours. Nope, everybody's dead. We have new orders. Lovely. The planes did a spiffing job. Right, well, we only lost 177 cash. We got 400 back, so we got a net gain of 223. We lost just over a thousand troops. We killed almost 8,000. So yeah, that was very successful. We got a net gain of 100 supply as well. Uh, we didn't get a net gain of supply. I didn't realise long we had a supply depot in. But it's no big deal. Supply is never a, a, an issue. Okay. So, let's see if they attack on their turn. So, they're continuing to attack Sam Menahol And... They are actually going to get a great victory if I auto-resolve, which is a little bit frustrating. So it looks like I need five cores here to protect against nine, which is not ideal. I'm going to auto-resolve it. There's a chance that it's not a great loss, but it was, unfortunately. So it's a major loss. Now, there is a chance that I'm going to get a great loss. It's got 10 cores that time. I wonder why the 9 cores against a non-battle fatigued had a great victory. Where with 10 against a battle fatigued, it's not. So we took a bit of a risk there. Could have got cut off. Okay, what were these? Limited exchange. 900 gold. Now, gold isn't massively important. It's only going to buy us more air wings, and we have already got loads, so... It's not hugely important. We've put one more core in Bastogne, so it's going to make it a little bit more challenging. Now, shall I move one of these from Verdun, because I don't think Verdun's going to get attacked. Or at least if it does, I don't think I'm going to lose four stars. So I think that should be enough, having six, oh no, five divisions in here. So we're going to attack Bastogne again. May as well Buy a couple more air wings. Rainy season, right. I think what I'm going to do then 
is not actually do a proper attack, just do a faint attack. Just to stop the star from regenerating. And then I'll wait for rainy season to end. Because I don't particularly fancy trying to get a great victory against three cores without my air wings. It's doable, but I'll incur a lot of gold losses. So I'd rather just play it safe and wait for rainy season to end. So yeah, let's do a faint attack. I'll do this off camera, no point in showing this. Okay. So we've put our faint attack in, so they're not going to get the star back. So let's see what they do on their turn. Unsurprisingly, back at St. Menahol again. But this time, because I've got that extra core here, it's only going to be a loss. So I'm just going to keep auto-resolving. You kind of lose the enthusiasm to replay the same mission over and over and over and over again. So uh, I'd rather just auto-resolve, save myself the time. I don't really care about the national will. Okay. Research points increased to two per turn. That's a lot sooner than I expected it to be. That's fantastic. So we now have enough to get some more infantry cores. Now I'm not going to bother going for this one because it costs four and it'll only get us one extra infantry core. So I'm not going to bother with that. So the choice is now, do I go for raiders and possibly flammenwerfers? Or do I go straight for tanks? Now obviously tanks would basically mean that I'm going to win. <laughs> But I might go for these raiders and flamethrowers, just for a bit of fun. I don't use them very often, so he'll make a nice change. So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. Okay, so we have four cores. So these four cores, I think I'm going to bring them all up to Long V. Yeah, I think I will. Has this still got a, an elite in? It has. So, let's take that elite out. I don't actually know what the Australian cores have in terms of bonus. So, I'm going to move the Indian core into St. Menahol. We have new orders. We have new orders. They can come with me into Longfeet. Let's see what this message is. Cradle of Civilization. Okay. It's very strange that they're not attacking these empty territories. <laughs> it is a, it's an odd one, that's for sure. Right then. So... Bastoin has still got three cores, but no heavy rain anymore. So that should be easily winnable now. May as well buy a couple of planes. And then off we go.
So, same deal as last time. I think if I bring everybody, ready yourselves. just get them ready. Mm, they have got an ob spoon. Oh no, they haven't got an ob spoon here this time. Okay. We need to hold I think this should be okay. Famous the last words. Attention. The brass wants this piece of ground. We have new orders. We here. We have new orders. We hold this ground. Stand by for orders. This position is ours. Ready yourselves. We need to hold this position. Attention. The brass wants this piece of ground. We have new orders. We hold here. Okay, well, we haven't been shot with artillery, so that's good. Shall I, <laughs> shall I take a massive risk and move with everybody? We have new orders. <laughs> this is, this is a stupid thing to do. Do not repeat this at home. Help if I actually hotkey these. Set positions. And ready on the double now. Oh dear, that's gonna be so painful. Splat. <laughs> Ah, it could have been worse. It could have been worse. Okay, off we go. Time to bring some planes up. I might just jump a couple in here. Ah. Wasn't prepared for that, was I? No, I was not. So yeah, I'm hoping that I'm going to start killing them as they spawn in. I'm just going to send one in at first. Just as a bit of a scout. It's not ideal to scout with an elite troop, but that's what we're doing. Okay. Can't really see anything. And there's no one here. How very odd. How very odd. Where is everybody? They've got three cores. They should have a lot of troops around. So where are they? Oh, there's some coming in. For bombing run. Just going to bring in some bombers. Load bombers for heavy ground targets. Ready bombers. I see no reason why not. Load for anti emplacement bombing. Load heavy bombs. Load 
a bombing run. This sortie, we target their ground forces. Look for moving ground targets. Right, so they're not seeming to spawn anyone in over here, which is a bit of a shame. And I don't think this is going to be a good place to catch them as they're spawning in. So I think I'm going to change tact. Ah, uh, they are spawning a few in. Yeah, they are still spawning them in, so yeah, I will carry on with this. So, let's just bring some more... ...troops over here. Yeah, they're bringing quite a lot in, that's, that's nice. Okay, some nice kills there. Three kills, basically. I'm in the forest, so they can't see me. This is perfect. Here are the artillery. I'm going to see if I can bomb the artillery. Okay, yeah, we've got 15 minutes, we've got plenty of time. Apparently they're bringing in a lot of troops here now. And they're actually trying to come towards me, which is not exactly ideal. But we're still managing to kill a lot of them. Yeah, I'm not quite sure how this is going to play out. I'll just leave it to resolve itself. Okay, the bomber's getting in a few hits on that artillery. That's nice. So let's... I don't really want to get in front of it until it's destroyed. How's this going? Could be better, could be worse. Okay, that's destroyed. So, time to start moving the troops out. Yeah, it's a bit awkward here now. Could probably do with bringing some reinforcements to help them. They're doing a, a good job though, doing a very good job. Yeah, they've done a really good job. Right, let's bring these to here. And then, I think I might even bring these into the trench. Now they've probably still got some troops here so just to make sure I'll do some suppression okay maybe not stand by for orders ready yourselves attention we're moving Stand by for we orders. need to go. Interesting. There does not seem to be much left. We need to hold this position. Yep. There is nothing left in X. 
So let's have a look at the trench system. There is a connection over here, so that's ideal. Let's bring one bomber in just in case. And then I can bring the rest of these up this way, I reckon. Don't think they're going to be bringing any more infantry in. I think they've spent all the reserves. Hmm, maybe not. Looks like they are still bringing some in. So I'm going to go for the risky approach. Hmm. The risky approach might be a little bit too risky, actually. It looks like they've got quite a few men here, so... Who's he firing up? These down here, is it? Ready yourselves. Ready on the line. We have new orders. Get in position. Stand by for orders. Ready on the line. Ready yourselves. These look like they're bugged out. So, I'm not sure where they're bugged out. Can't actually see the models anywhere. So let's just bring a load of infantry across. support ready for anti ground mission okay how are we doing here we're still taking it ready yourselves take firing positions we hold this ground yeah i'm confused as to where these troops are cuz that's a whole stack that is is that him there? Is he stuck in, in the trench? <laughs> oh dear. It's not great. A game that focuses on trench warfare and units can't use the trenches without getting stuck. That was foolish of it. Alright, let's get in here. doing here. I think we'll win that. So I'm just going to need to send in another couple here. I wish this would fix itself. Right then, let's see what they've got left down in Zed. Stand by for 
Right, yeah, I reckon that's it, to be honest. I don't think there's anything left. Oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, I could see that coming. As soon as I saw that he was bugged, I knew he was going to bug me out of the trenches. But yeah, this is over. All the victory points are taken. Bastoin has fallen. Well, region captured. Bastoin is ours. Once again, we got a net gain in the cash. So we got 34 cash. We got a load of these medals. And we got some more supply. Wonderful. Well, we're making fantastic progress, all thanks to the ridiculously OP air wings. But we are going to struggle to defend all these places. I mean, what I could do, <laughs> it's a stupid idea, but what I could do is pull these troops away from here to defend here. Now as long as I've got a path to Calais I think we're fine. We don't, er, uh, not Calais, Paris. I don't think we need Calais. So yeah, that is, <laughs> that is an option. If we feel as if we need to pull troops away. We can just pull them away from here. But anyway, I think we should call it an end to this episode. In the next one, we will hopefully be taking La Roche and Ardenne. And then we've got two more to take. So any of them will do. And then any of these. Okay. So... Cheers for watching, take care, and I shall see you in the next one.